What's up everyone? Hope you're having a great day. Uh, today, look, I wanted to talk about a trend that's happening on Twitch and I am not really sure if people are trying to be funny or if they are being serious. I cannot tell. But um, this is more of a video that, I, uh, that it, it's addressed to viewers. Um, as streamers, we absolutely love you guys. You know, you guys are why we do what we do. As streamers, we do, you know, we start our streams to, um, it's something that we like doing, but we also like interacting. We love entertaining you guys. Um, for the most of us, uh, it is something we do as, uh, it's something we love doing, interacting with you guys and talking to you and, and getting to know, you know, a whole you know, range of people and meeting people from all around the world. And it's an amazing thing. Um, but there has been a weird friend or a, a new a new phenomenon really in the last five years that i've been streaming it has i've never noticed it until honestly the last six months or so it's a it's a sense of viewer entitlement or viewer ownership rather that the viewer owns the streamer you do not we love you believe me we do and we appreciate all the support um you guys give us but don't for one second think that you own us, okay? Um, there's been, I've been doing a lot of variety streaming over the last few weeks and I've had people come in and say, I'm not gonna sub or I'm, that's it, I'm unfollowing because you're playing this game or that game. Um, cool. If that's how you feel, um, that's a shame and it's a bit of a reflection on you uh, more than me. I'm playing games because I like them and it's something that I wanna bring to the community uh, and you know, I want to try different things. It doesn't mean I'm stopping playing my main game or that, you know, I'm against the main game or anything like that. It just, you know, it's, if I play games for eight hours a day, I don't get a chance to experience other games unless I do it on stream. You know, I am streaming eight hours a day, so it's very hard for me to try new things unless I do it on stream because that's the only, you know, eight hours of gaming is so when I hear comments like, oh, you're playing such and such and, ugh, you know, oh, well, I'm going to unsub or I'm going to unfollow. Um, it might be said in jest, but honestly, it hurts. It cuts deep um, because to me, it's, I, I, I think that we've got more of a connection than just the game. Um, I, well, at least I hope we do, you know, and, and look, the vast majority of my, my viewers, um, they, they come along just to hang out with me and have a laugh with me and, and a, a part of the community and enjoy the community. But um, I'm seeing on Twitter and, and responses and people telling me stories um, of a sense of weird entitlement that, uh, oh, if you play such and such game, I'm not gonna follow you. If you do this, I'm, I'm unsubbing. But if that's how you feel, great. You know, it's a shame, but so be it. Don't, don't think that your, your sub gives you a right to dictate what we do, okay? It doesn't. We appreciate the subs. We appreciate any donations and that, absolutely. Without a doubt, it means the world to us. But that doesn't give you a right to uh, dictate. You know, you, you, don't, you don't own us. Remember that. We're people, okay? Yes, we are in the public and we are doing something on a daily basis out on the internet. And yes, it's public. But that doesn't give you that right to take ownership of us. So there is a line and people are starting to cross it. Uh, and and it's it's a scary, scary thing that I'm seeing and I, I really don't like what I'm seeing of late. Um, and the vast majority of people don't do this. The vast majority of people are sensible and they, you know, they're normal. And they know that um, if somebody is doing, is playing something that, that is different, that's fine. If you don't like it and you're absolutely opposed to it, you don't have to tune in. You don't have to announce that you're not liking it and you're leaving because you don't like it. That just makes you look like a douchebag. Don't be that guy. Um, if you don't like something, that's fine. Just move on. You know, when we play the game that you like, you can jump back in. Uh, most streamers would hope, and the what I go for is people who don't care what I'm playing, they're there to hang out with me. Um, they're there to, to enjoy the banter. They're there to, you know, uh, be part of the community and like I say the vast majority of the community are all over it they're 
they're there because you know they they feel a connection not only to me as the streamer but to the community as a whole you know they all interact even when i'm not around that's why we've got the discord channel i mostly step back from discord and let the community sort of have their own space to to interact with themselves with each other um but i'm seeing like i say i'm seeing on twitter and and things like this a, a sense of ownership and I don't know where it comes from, and I don't know why it's there, but please, please, just, just don't. It, it, it comes across, um, you know, it might even be as a joking thing, but streamers are, like, we put ourselves out there, and especially full-time streamers, this is what we do for a living. So, if you jump in and start saying these things, we, as streamers, have, have doubts, you know? It's like, oh, do I... You know, am I going to lose my entire community because I want to try a different game because that looks interesting over there and I want to see what it's about, you know? Um, I, I don't think it's fair. I don't think it's fair and I don't think a, a sub um, gives you that right, you know? For everybody who supports streamers with subs or donations or whatever it might be, you guys are the best. You, we, we abs I cannot stress it enough. We absolutely appreciate everything you do for us. Because without you, we have we have nothing, okay. But for those who sub and then and then feel that they are then owed something, um, you're misunderstanding the relationship. You know, the the subs that you give are to support something you're enjoying, uh, and to keep us, you know, uh, giving us the opportunity to do that, so you can get more of what you like. Again, if you don't like that somebody is going to play another game. Um, look, it's a shame, but it, it's fine. It's understandable, you know. Not everybody likes every game. But, I mean, that's that's the way it is. If you absolutely cannot stand the game and you, you, there's no redeeming feature of the stream other than the game that's being played for you, then that's fine and you can move on. But if, if that's the case, just, just move on. Announcing it, harassing the streamer about it is... is it's unfortunate and it, it sort of... It really kicks the streamer in the guts. It really, I mean, for me personally, when somebody says that, even as a joke, oh, you're playing this now, oh, pfft, I'm unsubbing, I'm, un I'm unfollowing. It, it makes me question whether or not the relationship we have is, you know, is there at all, or, you know, are we... I, I, I mean, this is basic human interaction, people. We are still people, we are still human beings, you know. You wouldn't say that to somebody else because they're listening to a different song that, that you don't like. You wouldn't go and say, well, I'm not your friend anymore. You just wouldn't, right? So don't do that to streamers, guys. I mean, try and be civil. If, you, if you're not, absolutely, there's no redeeming feature of the stream. There's an, uh, the only reason you're there for that streamer is that game. You like the way they play that game and therefore you're hanging out. And they decide to play something else and that, that's it for you. You cannot stand it. Then just move on quietly. Um, remember, streamers generally play games for, you know, minimum four hours a day, maybe eight hours. I stream eight hours a day and it wears on you, you know, I've been playing Warframe as my main game eight hours a day for a year and a half. I still love the game, but I've missed out on all these different games. Lucky 2018 was a pretty trashy for games, but I've missed out on all these other games because I'm focusing on my main game. Uh, now I've started in the last two, three weeks to put in a little bit of variety. I still do four to five hours of Warframe every day and I'm copping a whole heap of grief. And, you know, and that's that's just not sustainable. If, if you want the streamer that you like playing the certain game, you know, be it Warframe or anything else, to continue to do that, support them when they're trying to do something else just to keep their sanity up. Uh, you cannot continually play the same game day in day out day in day out forever without without a break the alternative of course is that people just abandon the game that you think you know they should be playing they will just abandon it because you've you know they're forced to to play it to death as viewers you get the flexibility if you don't want to play the game on that day you can try something else as streamers especially if you're eight hours a day streaming or more you don't have that flexibility so Keep that in mind when you um, when you're throwing these jokes, these jokes around because you know 
they affect the streamer. It's impacted me, and, and I've only been doing <laughs> literally three weeks worth of variety, and it's it's already playing it's playing you know playing a part, and it's already uh, it's already playing on my mind. Um, so if that's the case, and you absolutely can't stand X game, just move on. Go find go back to the main directory and find another streamer. If that's how you feel, it's super unfortunate, and we're sorry to lose you, but. You know, it, I'd rather lose somebody that um, like that and retain people who are there for the community. They're the bread and butter. They're the people that are going to follow me uh, and join me in other games if my main game happens to blow up and die. Uh, what do I do then? You know, think about that. Guys, don't give the streamer grief for, for trying to be, uh, trying, to, trying different games. I mean, it, it's... I don't know. I don't know, guys. Anyway, that's my thoughts on the situation. Um, I've just seen a lot of it lately, and I just thought I'd make a quick um, video. Sorry about the rambling effects, but it, but anyway. Uh, I'll leave it there, team. Thank you all for hanging out, and for everybody who has um, joined me on the, on the variety stream and hung out, and actually, you know, we've had a good time. It's been an opportunity to get people involved in, um, in different games, and also, for us to meet different people who don't play the main game being Warframe in this case. Um, we've been able to meet a whole bunch of new people just by doing a few variety streams. Uh, and it's been fantastic, you know? So yeah, please, please guys, keep that in mind. When when you uh, when you make jokes uh, in, in channels, just keep it in mind that, you know, we need a break too. Every now and again, we need a break. Uh, just as a, just as a indication, since the Twitch drops, on Warframe, uh, we've had a whole bunch of the Warframe streamers, the main, not the main, the popular Warframe streamers moving on. But they don't play Warframe anymore, why? Because they got burnt out. So allow your favorite streamer the flexibility to try different things so they don't get burnt out. That's gonna, like I say, that's gonna keep them in the game that you love for longer. So keep that in mind, guys. Anyway, I'm gonna leave it there, friends. Uh, for all those who do, who do, you know, stick around when I do switch games, I, I cannot thank you enough. It means the world to me that you're there, and I hope that you uh, enjoy, the, you know, seeing something new and being able to jump into something new with me. A lot of you have, a lot of you have joined me in. You know, we played a bit of Unreal Tournament, played a bit of Overwatch the other day, um, and that was fantastic. Everybody, you know, it seemed like people were having a good time, and so I, I know I enjoyed it. And for those who, who were part of that, I absolutely love you guys. You are the absolute best. So thank you very much. Uh, I will see you all on the next video. Please, if you haven't hit that subscribe button, please do so. Uh, we are trying to get up to that 1,000 subscriber mark. So uh, if we can get there, that'll be fantastic. I will give some uh, platinum codes for Warframe. Uh, once we hit that milestone, we'll do that and I'll make a new video and I'll uh, throw out some platinum codes for you guys. Until then, friends, take care. Have yourself a great weekend. I'll see you soon. Bye for now.